amazing. It's probably average. Good. I love the dining I think it's hall. pretty good. I feel like there's more options than other schools and different places to eat. My freshman year, we went to the dining hall every night and it was always good. They have a new dining hall with really good pizza. I feel okay. like JMU has one of the best dining food yeah. I've ever had out of every college I've been to. It's not ideal. Mine were great. It was kind of trash, not gonna hold you. I strongly believe I had the worst a dorm on this campus my freshman year, 100%. I hated my freshman dorm. It was Liddy's smallest place I've ever seen in my life. It weren't too good, it was really hot. And uh, the dorms are really old. I had by about five fans. It wasn't that clean either. They were very it hot, was, we didn't have AC. Yeah. Freshman year it was nice, it was really spacious. Uh, I live on a newer part of campus, East Campus. A lot newer and nicer. <laughs> Not very racially diverse. Lack of diversity. I mean, walking around, like, you don't see a lot of, like, familiar faces. Definitely see blacks on the sports teams, but not just in the, like, general population. You learn to adapt. Walking on campus and having to go up all the hills because we're in the mountains. I would walk to my classes. Time I got to my class, I'd be dripping sweat. During the winters, it just gets really cold, especially with the winds. We have two separate campuses, which we're split by a highway. And then sometimes you have, like, classes 15 minutes apart, and they're completely across campus. I think at any time you used to you need, they will complain about parking, pay a lot of money for parking permits, and so trying to find a spot and having to come to campus like an hour and a half early was difficult. Also, when the gates are down, that sucks, sucks too. Sucks. You can't go anywhere on campus. It's yeah. like it only opens like certain like service vehicles and buses, and then like if you're not one of those vehicles, you can't get on the campus except in designated parking spots that are not within those gates around all around campus. The students aren't heard as much as they should be. They don't ask for our opinions when they make big decisions that impact us on our day to day basis on this college. Back to we're kind of so divided. Some people want to be on campus, some people don't. That kind of creates a big clash of heads. Some classes are offered in person. Some are not. Personally, I'm an in-person type of guy. Specifically for education purposes, it's the best method of delivery. Outgoing. Easy to talk to. I would say it's pretty friendly and welcoming. Like when you're in classes and stuff, like you get to talk in small groups and stuff like that. Everyone's like nice and you get to know them a little bit. And no one's like rude and people hold the doors for you. It's like our thing. Everyone holds the door. It's just a nice community. If you want to join Greek life, there's a chapter for everyone here, honestly, and I think you find your people. That when you're in Greek life, it seems like it's a lot bigger than it really is. I'm in a sorority and I love it. I found like my new family and made lots of friends being part of it. They're friends for life. Won my wedding, all that, all that stuff. So really help meet new people when you're a freshman. People who aren't in Greek life able to like join clubs or have friends through freshman year or even sophomore year, or whatever. It's definitely not everything. It's a pretty big part of JMU. If you want to do any extracurriculars, partying, going out. Greek life is the focal point of that. For a lot of opportunities, just like networking, post grad, maybe become closer to a bunch of dudes that I probably wouldn't know if I didn't join Greek life. If you're a guy, you pretty much have to be in a fraternity in order to go to a fraternity party. If you're a girl, you can go to pretty much anything. You gotta be in something in order to be somebody. It's so fun on the weekends. Thursday, Friday, Saturdays are always a good time. Um, we've got UREC. That facility is the biggest gym on the East Coast. If you're not into partying, like there's a ton of other things to do. There's a gap view, which is a puppy place you can go and see dogs. People like to go hiking. Ski resort, literally probably like 10, 20 minutes away. We would go downtown a lot. It's like a really good geographic location. My freshman year was awesome. Living in the dorm, I'd go back and do it in a heartbeat if I could. Probably going to the national championship with a team as a freshman. Football games. Everybody's there, and plus we win, so. Definitely college game day freshman year. ESPN came. The entire quad was like full of just students and people. There were signs everywhere. I think for me, like that's something that always stands out. Big Nats get a big stack. I'm rich, I'm trying to go air that. Shit, I'm rich, I'm trying to beat your neck.